Hey guys, this is Cyber98610, and I'm opening a legendary collection. I ordered this from StrikeZoneOnline.com, so go there and uh, get yours. Really cool. I like how the cards are actually there. You know, it's, I thought it was like a picture of them at the beginning, but the cards are right there, like in the little windows. So that's really cool. All right, let's do this without messing it up. Uh, I don't think anything will be for trade from here. Maybe something from the packs if I get something cool. Since I'm a collector. Also, uh, the mat that's in the background, it is for sale, so if you want it, send me an offer. Let's see. Hmm, that's pretty nice. Cool. You can take that off, like glue, I'll get that off later. Like a little spot of glue where they keep that paper on. And, as you can see, your god cards are over there, so I guess you just pull these things off and you can take them off. You could also put other cards in there, so I might do that. And, uh, let's see, how do you open this thing? There's like a little flap. And, I was wondering what artwork they were going to use or what. I was hoping it'd be new art, but these are really cool versions. I don't think they're going to be for trade, because they just look so cool. I like that version of Red Eyes. I've always liked that one. Alright, uh, oldest pack first. How about that? Maybe I'll get something cool, I don't know. You pretty much gotta get this pack for at least the god cards. And the binder's really neat. A lot of old cards kinda neat. Giant Soldier of Stone, that's my rear. Can't go wrong with the old packs, they're always kinda neat to open since I've played Yu-Gi-Oh! since it first came out. Dream Clone, I think I actually needed one of those. Great Moth. Got a couple of cards actually out of that pack I needed for that uh, clown control deck. That's not bad. I wonder if I'll get a hollow. Nemo Mamonger. Pharaoh Servant. Ah, oh, limited removal. Oh, that's weird. They must have changed up the packs where um, there's rares and hollows when they reprinted them. That's kind of weird. Limited removal, though. That's pretty cool. I think that's going to be for trade. I don't think I'll need it. Yeah, I got a hollow. Maybe that Duel's Revolution bad streak then will be done with. I have some luck when I get a box of Star Strike. Different dimension gate. It's funny to see all these old cards. I can see we got a hollow stumbling. Yay. Uh, Orca Mega Fortress. That's kind of neat to get. And a let's see, Curse of Darkness. The light was weird, so I couldn't read it. So yeah, that's pretty neat. I got two hollows. Not bad. Like I said, it's mainly for the god cards you gotta get this set for anyway. And Dark Magician all out. Let's see if I can get the god cards out to show them to you guys real quick. There's Raw. They make sure they don't fall out. Slifer. I remember, god cards can't be used in a duel. They're just cool collectors, and of course these are real. So this is your way to get 100% real cards. God cards. Since there's so many fakes that have been floating around for the years. So yeah, whole set of god cards. Feel the power. And they also have the colored backs. Alright, and uh, hopefully you guys enjoyed this pack opening. Be sure to check out my contest. Uh, I have random drawing for a custom deck box and a Dark Souls first place for the other contest. So I actually have two going on and both of them will end when I reach 3,000 subscribers. So to be sure to check that out and uh, subscribe. That's all. Bye YouTube.
Today's video is sponsored by StrikeZoneOnline.com. StrikeZoneOnline.com has easy navigation to find any card or pack that you're looking for, and also has some of the best gaming supplies out there. With their easy payment options, you can buy whatever you need from StrikeZoneOnline.com. So go check it out today.